My name is Niara Williams. I'm a senior at Duchenne Academy. And this is the beginning of many ellipses. Once upon a 10-year-old summer night's dream, I woke up with cicadas buzzing in my ears and wet underwear. Drowsily, I thought, huh, I peed. As if bedwetting was still acceptable by the time I reached the fifth grade, as I rolled to the edge of my mattress, I felt a gushing sensation between my thighs. Oh, God. Oh, no. This is far too viscous to be urine, too sticky and coming out of the wrong place. No, no, I'm imagining this. My stomach isn't curling and a telltale menstrual knot. My uterus is not making an early evacuation. My mother has three sisters, Auntie Rita, Auntie Nay, and Auntie Shonda. And I'll be damned if my grandmother is young enough and fertile enough to give birth to an Aunt Flo. Okay, okay, I'm thinking this doesn't have to be what I think it is. It doesn't matter that both my sisters got theirs at the same age, in the same season, in the same room. There is nothing blooming in the crotch of my white and purple striped panties. The scent of blood is not overwhelming my sinuses. I heard you can't go swimming in the ocean anymore after. The sharks can smell it on you. <laughs> do I have to carry tampons now? How do the shining pink packages fit? Do I just shove it up there or wipe with it? Irrelevant, this isn't a period. As my sheets are stained, this isn't a period. As my body cramps, as the sun rises, as I awkwardly waddle to the bathroom down the hall with the heavy wetness in my crotch, as I sit over the toilet, eyes shut and hands balled into fists. I open one eye slowly, then the other. There, glimmering, crimson in the seat of my pants is the grammatically correct ending to my biological girlhood. <laughs> <laughs>